Hi guys, welcome back. If you're new, my name is Shelby and welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are reviewing the new Anastasia Powdered Bronzer and Anastasia Amrezy Highlighter. So we're going to put these two products to the test, see if they're really worth the money, if they're really good. You guys have no idea how excited I am about this highlighter. But first, we must apply bronzer and blush and then we can get to the highlighter. So first the powder bronzer. I got this in Tawny and now that I'm looking at the shade it looks a little red so I got the one for medium skin tones I'm really light I don't know why I did that Anastasia's new packaging with like their blushes bronzers now and highlighters make me want to cry it comes in a pretty large pan this is a pretty big size compared to my head it's 0.35 ounces or 10 grams and this is a powder bronzer for face and body to create a natural matte traceless finish for buildable coverage and this retails for $28, so that's really not bad for a high-end bronzer. And this is the Light Terracotta Brown. So, we're just going to dip right in with my favorite bronzer brush. This is from Crown. I don't know, I just love the shape of it. It's perfect for my size head, a small head. Nice little coat on this brush. I don't know how pigmented this is. Tap off the excess and... <sighs> Let's hope. Okay. I actually love this color. It looks really like red toned in the pan, but on my skin, it gives a nice flush of bronze. It's not too red. It's not too like yellow toned. It's very pigmented, very blendable. It looks gorgeous. Of course, it's matte, so I love matte bronzers. So I'm going to dip in a couple more times and apply this to my forehead. It's so blendable. Oh my goodness. I'm going to hit my jaw with this as well. I know you're supposed to put contour down here, but I put bronzer because, I mean... I don't even contour my face. Um, I don't know. I just don't like doing it. I feel like it makes my face shape look weird. So a little bronzer down here. Bring it down the neck. And that's what the side of the bronzer looks like. I think it looks stunning. I'm obsessed with this color. I'm really happy I got this color. I was a little nervous just looking at the pan, but very satisfied with it. I'm going to contour slash bronze my nose a little bit with this. This is how I've been contouring my nose. Um, I don't know, I just feel like it's a little bit more natural, not so harsh. We are all bronzed up. I'm loving this bronzer. I'm going to throw this in my crease as well because why not? I'm going to be honest, I'm obsessed. I think this is totally worth the money. I'm very satisfied very happy with the product and i love how it also comes with a mirror so i mean you can use this for your brows you can even use this to apply the bronzer perfect obsessed love it oh my goodness wouldn't really expect anything less from anastasia i mean i feel like she really kills it with everything the anastasia highlighter with amrezy oh my goodness super obsessed with this packaging it's so cute i love the little stars all around and then her name is right on it, and then once you open it up, of course it has a mirror, just like the powdered bronzer, same compact, just a little bit prettier. I love how it has that rippled imprint, it makes it look even more luxurious, and just, it's different. We've never seen a highlighter like this with this type of imprint in it, at least I haven't, and just, oh my goodness, in this color. So I'm going to first swatch it. I'm going to give it a one, two, three, four, five. Heck yes. Of course I'm going to use my Anastasia A23 highlighting brush with this. I'm just going to dip in a couple times. Has a lot of product on there and oh I forgot blush. First layer obsessed. I think this is so pretty. I was a little nervous that it was going to be a little too golden toned and like dark for my skin tone, but 
It looks stunning. I like to bring my highlighter pretty much all the way down my cheeks so in like pictures or just looking at people they can see the highlight right here. I don't know, I just really like that effect. I don't think this highlighter really emphasizes your texture a lot. It kind of just looks like a wet highlighter on your skin. They're both gorgeous, blend very nicely, don't emphasize texture, just look very airbrushed on the skin and that's what I love in both of these products. Alright guys, and this is what the bronzer and highlight look like on both sides. I think they are stunning. They're not that expensive. I mean $28 for a really good product that's high end is really not that bad. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this little review, first impression of the new Anastasia highlighter and powder bronzer. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to hit that subscribe button and that little notification bell next to it to be notified every second I upload. But I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. I don't like the